The loss of a pet can be very traumatic, especially if the dog or cat has been with the family for a long time. Well, now there's a company in town specializing in helping families deal with that loss. It's called a beloved friend's pet crematory. It's where animals who have died can be cremated and sent home again with their owners. More in this new chapter of John Tyson's Journal. There is no grief than that of the loss of a loved one. And in many cases, the grief is over the loss of a dog or a cat that has been with a family forever. Steve and Elaine Woods are very familiar with grief. Steve is a former Washoe County Deputy Coroner, and Elaine is a retired nurse. Together, they have created a special place where families can grieve and have their animals cremated, then placed in a special urn to be taken home. And we, we believe all pets should be home at night, every night. A beloved friend's pet crematory is more than just a place to cremate remains. It's also a pet funeral home, where families can spend time with their animals before they are cremated. Now, it might seem strange to have a funeral home and a crematory for pets, unless... Yes, we've had people tell us that they've cried more when their pet died than they did at their parents' funerals. In each room, there was a poster with the story of the Rainbow Bridge. It's about pets who have died and then go to a bridge this side of heaven where their bodies are healed until such time as their owners arrive. Their reunion is glorious. They then pass over the bridge together. Steve and Lane are providing the first step in that journey, and the people who bring their pets here couldn't be more pleased. Uh, we could be half the people that a dog thought we were. We'd have a long ways to go. John Tyson, Colorado 8 News Now. That's true.